You could do that. Yeah, you could do that. Oh! An Illidan Medusa. Like, oh, they're gonna come really close to that Dire Observer Ward. And in fact, Dyer's Puppy now walks tower. under it, and they, attack. okay, they smoke under the Dire Observer Ward. He's work. still hovering around that top rune, however, and not easy. No shark available with a search on Puppy. Yo, he was the man that pings the movement. And then it ends up giving first blood over to the Timbersaw. Maybe he just assumed they were going to come straight up to that top lane and not go through the river, but yeah. Void on Illidan, that Iron Shell's burning through his shield really quickly, and the body block by Puppy is there perfectly too. Iron Man has to tether over to lend a bit of an aid, but now actually ends up getting himself killed for his efforts. Puppy, they need a little bit of control. Void's going to kick in. Envy makes his way up with the sun from Pilot Eye. Pasha's dead. Yeah, look like Pasha, Pasha's waiting. You've got Pilot Eye around the corner. Uh, the Hawk is actually scouting him out. Now Raw Envy, he knew what was coming at him. Then like, the way the Beastmaster either. was posturing, he knew you had something. Okay. Now you're gonna actually relocate in the Lena. So the Life Striker Ray sets up a pile, I die, and F5, get a good couple heroes. Yeah. So that was in the back of my mind for her, but it makes sense, he goes into the Bloodstone too. Chakram forward, Yol, that Chakram is gonna hold him in there just long enough that Eternal Envy could Chikuchi through, find the kill, and they push for more. we chain forward, BZZ, Life Striker Ray's gonna miss on absolutely everything. Laguna, oh boy. That is a quick time lapse at the right time. Stone Gaze coming out from Illidan. Arteezy tries to turn himself for a split second. No one gets Dyer's turned to stone, top. and now they can Sunday turn and try and fight. RMN relocate off in one second time. Finger of Death will cancel that one. Roars on Puppy, but can you kill off? Yep, they can. They kill off the Night Stalker. This would be a good window for them to take a fight. This is just before Bulba will be finishing up that oh, mechanism. Arteezy, chain forward. Shocker is out. We're going to jump ourselves quickly for a bit. Let the lag end. And, uh, well, you call Bulber in position, able to get that Lacuna Blade off, but Arteezy with the Chakram, Pylai die, Finger of Death tries to return the damage, but RMN's already there with the six charges on the tether. Pylai die is now going to drop, and Arteezy's in too deep. Yol doesn't have the purge, but he's starting to stack up the poison. Nice. And with the disruption, they wrap around him, and they're going to bring down Artur. He just finished the Bloodstone too, so welcome to eight charges. Puppy's trying to creep skip the wave, but he's got no life and also no mana. And uh -oh. with a relocate... The biggest tirade of all in this new be the, you know, maintain vision control and be able to decide on what fights you know you'll be able to win. What the hell? Good for you, RTZ. You, <laughs> you got those trees. Greenpeace is not on RTZ's wish, uh, like Christmas card list. Ooh, Arcane Bottled Up. That is a wonderful uh -huh. Super Sovereign. We're gonna disrupt, catch her. Purge available too, Arteezy, they relocate up, Laguna Blade's gonna connect, Arteezy, Thank he you, wants hood. to survive, triggers the hood. She's very happy to expend that. Team Secret actually have to come back, Arteezy wants to push one more wave, and then BT home. Radiance middle tower is under attack. And in fact, he didn't mean to do that. <laughs> <laughs> maybe he did. Maybe he was trying to actually make it so Eternal Envy had a little bit more money. Because uh, EE, now he comes back, throws out the bugs, looking for a kill on Pasha. Remember these Necropooks, they're already down and ill and caught inside that Chakram, making it difficult to get out of range of the Mana Drain of Pylai Dai, which he did prioritize as well. That's four points up at the Mana Drain. They're trying to make the most out of the control timing to, to just reduce Illidan's power. She's turning into a serious raid boss, and with so much defensive preparation by a five with the disruption and with the, the wisp, it's going to be hard, oh, but... Good finger. Oh. There goes the SD. Illidan turns on the stone gaze. He's trying to get rid of the bugs during this time, but Puppy sees all. Radiant's Thanks to that Aghanim set to the stairs. Attack. Tether forward, Iron Man. Going to go out, but this actually just means that you get a guaranteed to two kills. Hmm. Oh. And now they're going to see the wisp come back. Yeah. Oh. Bit awkward there, and unfortunately, it's going to cost F5 quite a bit. They had a good siege on forward here. We'll see if F5 can take, uh, take advantage of that little window when he doesn't have it. That's the perfect point, man. Like it's yeah. uh, it's the fact that Envy hasn't pulled his item yet, and you're going to show the butterfly. It's going to be big if they can contest Roshan. But Pylai die, low mana. He's uh, as in for mana drain. Already gets rid of the illusions, which want to scout out. There's poison, Roshan. They just jump oh. up. They want the fight. The back is there. Beautiful. With the double sum from Pylai Die. You can say goodbye to Yol as well as Pasha. Defensive imprisonment is going to actually buy a little bit of extra time. But Illidan stands his ground. Still no stone gaze. It's on cooldown for 12 more seconds. They're trying to burn through the shield, but it's taking forever. And Bulba, he tries to run out and run out in front of Illidan. That was not going to work. 
Poppy's ready to break for the tree line. Silence up BZZ and keeps him out. It's Arteezy who is now able just to chain himself out and get Nagus the Immortal. I actually thought that was going to be a, a secret all day kind of a fight. They, it looked uh, like a wonderful Agus. show for F5. I guess. Oh, my bad. <laughs> He's good, but F5 are still here. Wait, are they CJ. coming over? They're coming over. Envy wants to scour him from behind, but the ball is going to scout yep. this out. Yep. There goes your smoke. It breaks on BZZ, but the blink roar up. They want pumping. If they can take his gem with it, then Pasha is going to be laughed all the way. The bank, the back will keep him away for a bit, but not long enough. Now the vision game goes the way of F5, and Team Seeker in the world of hurt. Eternal Envy, the Yules will send him up. They want the kills. Uh -oh. He hits the ground. They got it too. He can't hide Envy. No buyback for Envy for a full minute. F5 are charging down this mid lane, Toby. This is two lanes of Rax. This Where is actually is two lanes of Rax. F5. F5. Yep. Taking it to secret here with the Medusa Illidan. This is They're playing terrific Dota. The Medusa is so big, it can't be stopped. I think Pasha has been one of the most instrumental like, heroes in this game so far. And the combos are just not landing for Team Secret. To be honest, I thought Seeker's high ground defense was going to be a hell of a lot better than this, but they just never, they can't. Found a good oh, opening, now Bulba back, a four-man Ravage done with Whoa. the Dark oh. oh. That's what you're waiting for, but still, it's too little too late. Hilden is so fat right now, he is going to fit through the burrow door and just take down Poppy underneath his own tier 4 towers. RMN might be stunned for a bit. But Arteezy, you want to keep fighting this one? Ironman just tethers himself out. Arteezy, okay, he gets the chain. They get the gem of true sight back again. So a small recovery. And that was thanks to that uh, initial kill over on the Beastmaster. BZZ lost as well. This is initiation. F5 all here. Ultimate wise, everyone's got everything. Elder's in very, very deep. But really, it's Team Secret. They bypass the front lines. They're looking for the back fight. The roar on Envy, keeping him out. Can he time left? No, he can't. Laguna Blade will kill him off in time. But Arteezy is still a two for one. And there's your buyback. They want to come back into the fight with the time left. It's the Eternal Envy special looking to just put in the damage. But Elder's so big. Puppy can't run away. The Scardi locks him down. And now it's Arteezy. Cooching, I mean, uh, tibetaning away. Bulba can't get himself out. There's too many illusions from Illidan. Try and slow him down. There's your stun from Pilot Eye. Finally, some space being created. And Arteezy, they can come wow. back down. But can they kill the Colossus? They can they everyone. kill Illidan? The Hex is up. He's still got evasion. They still need more damage. Arteezy has no more mana. They have stuns available. And they will bring him down. Finally, Illidan will have his first death of the game. Yeah, they're just... Their eyes are on the prize, and that's bottom lane, Rex. Uh, but they're all going to be there. They find the courier coming in. It's only got sentry wards. Puppy still going to take care of it. And now that it's like, well, boys behind us. They didn't even move. Like, uh, no body language change. This, this, never this, happened. Is, this is a straight Rex Radiant rush right yeah. now. They want to end this game. They do not want Radiant it to go on any longer. Obs and sentries behind. Arteezy in through the front. They've lost the creep wave, however. You have Pylite Dives behind, so they don't have the combo position. You've still got Envy attacking that top lane. So while the battle continues, Elder takes the ground. He needs to bring down this melee Rax to make this push worth it. And he's going to be able to do it with the Manta left behind. Now you turn on the Stone Gates. You get RTC to chain away. Remember what you're here for. Fortification slowed it down. And they actually just relocate up to the top lane. They kill off Envy, but Envy already took out the top lane. Yep. He took out the top Rax, but they're coming back. The night time will end. And how many do they bring back? They bring back Illidan. He'll isolate up Puffy. The rest of Seeker, they're diving forward. They want the leaner. The Yules will dodge for now, but that's still double Chakram into the chain. Finger of Death. Yol will defensively imprison himself up. As he comes back out, he'll also die. Iron Man, tether your heart away. Needs to run with Illidan. Forced off him to get out of range of Bulba. But Bulba with a blink dagger. Too easy to keep, to keep up with him. And now even Pasha doesn't want to be involved in this either. Too bad. <laughs> he goes down. Arteezy beyond godlike now. Defend the high ground. So it's going to be interesting to see if they have any sort of respectable high ground defense. They Old have smoke. good wave clear, but Arteezy moves forward. 
Iron Man's the one to be scouted out. He needs to get himself oh, out of here. Gone. Finger of death very, very quick. The smoke flank is coming over. It's actually down into Roshan. Pasha going to focus on Envy. Can he burn off the manor in time? Yep! They bring down the total Envy and Illidan. He's turning Poppy to stone. They need more damage, and there it is. The rapier pickup. Illidan, he is going to be the manliest of all men. Oh. Poppy will drop, and it is F5. <laughs> who uh -oh. have brought down three heroes. They want to get Roshan as well. If they can secure the Aegis, the more they can push. This is Oh, perfect. okay. Maybe you can just find a kill. You can kill off Arte. Easy. That'll secure him more. He's dead. Yep. Body block from Pasha. The timber chain's still going to go. Arte, oh. maybe not so dead. He's no out. disruption. A rapier isn't enough to uh, repair Envy's deficit. No. But he'll be happy if he can get a puppy with the Ags, able to see him pretty deep. Y'all, yeah, he knows, he knows. Pilot Eye jumps forward. They want the kill. Stone Gaze turns on. Y'all, RMN actually negates enough of the damage. they will end up surviving. The roar goes up on Puppy. And now you can say goodbye, that true vision. Bulba wants to go for the back combo. He can't really get it off. The gem is still sitting on the deck here as Eternal Levy ripping apart BZZ. Ooh. But Illiton, he hits harder. <laughs> He is a Mack truck at the moment. The relocate coming forward. They'll see Pilot IT being out. And he can't be there to defend. This is bad for Secret. Let's see if they can hold. They have fantastic wave clear, though. Double yep. Chakram. And we've seen the mini Wombo combo factor. They have to hope oh, they can pull out easy. He's jumping. He's going for the back lines. He wants to find the kills. He does not want to deal with Illidan. And rightly so, but he now has to chain himself back inside as Illidan slowly forcing his way into Mega's puppy oh, has man. to go set to survive through all of this. You bring down the Beastmaster, the back line, it's Eternal Envy trying to ping, uh, actually keep them distracted. So Illidan has no extra support, but he doesn't even need it. He's a one-man army at the moment, and they bring down Envy. A hundred seconds without the Weaver. Four star from Puppy, but the damage from Illidan is just too strong. You can't repel firepower of this magnitude of Medusa. You will continue to force your way through, and you will be taking this game at five off Team Secret. Fantastic five, the better open qualifier team, Toby. <laughs> can't they believe are. it. My god. Team Secret. If only they face Bulma up can't against get the wall up. There it is. There it is, but it's not enough. You get one, but you still got Illidan. And even the Illidan illusion is not going to be able to stand the Illidan. It wait, looks wait, like it's going to be it. Can they drain him? No, Pilot I can't even stand here. Illidan finishes the game. Our team wow. is dying, and there it is. Wonderfully G -G. done from Fantastic Five, man. I got to say, came into this match, it's like, yeah, secret. Yeah, secret. But they got the Medusa farmed out of control. Their draft just looked so good, Team Secret. Like, like you could see it right at the end too. Like, there was no control over Weaver and Timber. They could do whatever the hell they wanted.